stage, your host, Joanna Showalter. spend on laughter, so too are you one breath closer to death. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> initially I started painting a bunch of misaligned, bleeding eyes, but the person was speaking to me and wanted me to paint David Ray because he looks like an Amish skeleton. <laughs> He died and he was buried and they exhumed his skull. <laughs> anyway, here he is. <laughs> I like to think I really captured the terror in his eyes. <laughs> Excited to see my painting. <laughs> I uh, got some good news. I've been reading a lot about how to do stand-up comedy online. <laughs> and they say you should talk about what you look like. You know. You know, they said my name is Nick Nemiroff, but I'm sure some of you guys are thinking, like, in this shirt, these, these pants, I kind of look like a mix between Howard and Joanne Nemiroff. <laughs> i got some Hojo fans here, very cool. I, uh, I, uh, I went to a pig roast recently, uh, but I thought we were all going to poke fun and make lighthearted jokes about a pig, but deep down we really respect him. <laughs> we, uh, we just ate it. <laughs> Wasn't very funny. <laughs> but uh, I wrote some jokes for the for the event that I thought it was gonna be. <laughs> I'm gonna do those for you guys now. Just, just pretend that there's a, a pig in a tuxedo. <laughs> Christian, thanks for having us. Now, uh, folks, as we all know, Christian and Olivia have been married for 10 years, have ten, uh, you know, three beautiful children, and Tommy. <laughs> Tommy, I'm just kidding, you're my godson, I love you. <laughs> now, in the spirit of the roast, I actually called up Olivia trying to get some dirt on you, Christian, because, uh, hey, I know how much you love that. <laughs> But, uh, but seriously, folks, no, Olivia didn't have anything bad to say. Okay, maybe that's a bit of a fib. <laughs> Olivia did say that uh, she wished Christian did things a little more spontaneously. I was like, what do you mean, like cook you dinner, give you a massage? She goes, uh, how about uh, combust? <laughs> <laughs> no, but, uh, 
but, but seriously, folks, no, but seriously, Olivia is uh, such a lovely lady, such a lovely lady. I actually uh, was talking to Christian the other day. Christian told me that Olivia is a freegan. I was like, oh yeah, cool, I read an article about them, that's pretty cool. She's like a dumpster daddy, vegan, no carbon footprint, that's pretty cool. Christian's like, you didn't let me finish. Olivia is a freegan, annoying wife. <laughs> No, seriously, no, but seriously, folks, I, uh, I actually heard that uh, Christian has a, a very hairy bum bum. Those, those, you know, the pigtail ain't the only curl, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> Uh, folks, I actually heard that Christian's bum bum is so hairy. How hairy was it? It just met Sally. Folks, so... <laughs> but folks, no, seriously, though, but seriously. Uh, we got some great guests here. We got some great guests. Oh my god, Quinn Tarantino, most personal friend. Q, I love you, buddy. A lot of people accuse Quinn Tarantino of having a foot fetish, but. Uh, I wouldn't say he has a foot fetish. No, no, I would say it's more of a uh, foot fet, definitely. <laughs> no, folks, but seriously, but seriously, for real. For real, Clinton, uh, when, I, when I told him the uh, Empire State Building was, uh, you know, 140,000 feet high, he said, uh, I want to fuck that building. <laughs> Seriously, seriously. Actually, I have a lot of respect for Q. A lot of respect. He always helps out the little guy, you know, because of his involvement in that indie horror flick, Hostel. Remember that movie, Hostel? Yeah, it's uh, like Saw. Remember Saw? <laughs> you don't know Saw or Hostel. <laughs> Everybody except him. <laughs> or Flick Haas. Oh, Quentin Tarantino, a lot of people don't know this, he was the executive producer on that movie. And because of his involvement, it actually grossed $60 million in its opening weekend, which is a lot for a small horror movie. But I went back, rewatched it, turns out it actually grossed me out. <laughs> but seriously, folks, we got some other great <laughs> Oh my god, we got uh, Quentin. Oh no, I already said that. <laughs> Folks, oh my god, we got uh, Flavor Flav. I cannot believe it. No, wait. They're saying Flavor Flav is going to be late. I guess he forgot to set his alarm necklace. Okay, folks. <laughs> folks, no, but seriously, folks, we got some great guests. We got Tom Cruise, unbelievable. Biggest movie star in the world, Tom Cruise, is here. Tom Cruise, not his real name. Tom Cruise is, you know, short for a grown man. <laughs> Tommy, I'm just kidding around, man. I'm just kidding around. No, Tom, I have a lot of respect for you, too. He actually insists, at his age and his status, he insists on doing all his own stunt men. <laughs> Folks, no, I'm just kidding around. Tom Cruise, no, I love you, man. I love you, man. I uh, actually, yeah, no, he's one of the proudest, most outspoken, practicing sign shortages. <laughs> Seriously, folks, <laughs> I, uh, I just want to give a big um, thank you to Christian for putting this whole night together. Um, you seriously have been such a good friend to me. Uh, you know, me with my, my, you know, my gambling addiction. And, uh, I love you, man.
listening to you. Wow. <laughs> We had a laugh, didn't we? <laughs> so this is my portrait of Nick. Woo! I drew him crying because he wept for the pig. <laughs> I also observed that he looks and acts like if Michael Sarah had a weird older brother. 